Okay, here we go. Exclusive access. This tool allows us to build a team of virtual assistants. When I say virtual assistant, I mean agent. When I say team, I mean swarm. So team member is to team as agent is to swarm. Hopefully that makes sense. The way we add agents to our swarm is we can actually do this in two ways, but the first way I'll show is by clicking this add agent button. This gives you a field where you can customize the team member or agent. Each team member is going to get a name. And here is where you can specify the team members persona. So we will say you are great at producing content for LinkedIn. Before I click this button to update the swarm, we also have to define our flow. So the flow defines how the messages we send to the swarm are going to flow through the swarm. We only have one team member in our swarm at the moment. So we have to specify the team member like so. This means that when we send a message to our swarm, this team member will receive our message, generate its output, and return the output to us. So now I can update the swarm, <laughs> right? And if I say, hello, you can see our agent is responding accordingly. Let's now add another team member or agent to our swarm, team member two. And this team member will be great for marketing content on, let's say X, aka Twitter. Here, we'll add a comma, then specify the second team member. What this means is that when we send a message to our swarm, the message we send will be received by the first team member and by the second team member in parallel. If we were to specify an arrow here, what this means is the message we send to the swarm would be received by the first team member. The first team member would generate its output and the output of the first team member would be passed to the second team member. The second team member would generate its output and would return it back to us. Most of the time, you're going to keep this very simple, but sometimes you can do cool things by tweaking how the message flows through the swarm. We'll keep it simple for now. We'll edit the swarm and let's say hello again. And you can see each team member responds in parallel. So defining our swarm manually like we've been doing is great, but we actually have another option as I hinted at the beginning. We can use this swarm builder to generate a team for us given a prompt. Let's specify this prompt. Create a team of expert digital marketers specialized in producing content for the following platforms, X, Facebook, Instagram, and LinkedIn. The content each marketer generates should be hyper-optimized for connecting deeply with the intended audience. Let's run the swarm builder and see what happens. So you can see our agents have been created for us. And the swarm builder also suggested how the messages we send to the swarm should flow through the swarm. And they kept it very simple. No surprises there. So now if we update the swarm and send a message to our swarm, for example, let's send this message. Market a new web application called Swarms Playground available at demo.swarms.world. You can see the Twitter marketer gives us some content for Twitter. The Facebook marketer gives us some content for Facebook. The Instagram marketer gives us some content for Instagram. And the LinkedIn marketer gives us some content for LinkedIn. So this is amazing. This, you know, just a couple months or years ago would have taken hours, if not days. That gives you a good overview of how this tool works. Let me show you this other tool, which is also very useful for content generation. So here I have 
preloaded a swarm that is specialized for marketing on various social media platforms. And what this swarm does is output the generated content for each member of the swarm into a spreadsheet. So if I send this message again, market a new web application called Swarms Playground available at demo.swarms.world. We can see each of the marketers generating its output. And when all of the marketers have finished generating their content, we'll be presented with a spreadsheet that we can download. We can download the spreadsheet and import this into any tool that is capable of reading spreadsheets. And this is fantastic because we can pass this on to other team members who can edit this and make sure it gels well with the overall brand of the company that we're doing this work for.